Welcome to Hectanuga One. Hi everyone, this is Emmy. Today I'm going to show you how to crochet this cute little hedgehog. Today I'm going to work with Red Heart Super Saver yarn and a 5mm crochet hook. I'm going to make the face in this color and I'm going to do the body with two strands of this brown color. Let's start with a slip knot. Chain 5. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Slip stitch to join and form a ring. Now carry this yarn in along the outside of the ring. I'm going to chain 1 and I'm going to make 5 single crochet in the ring. Four and five. Now I'm going to slip stitch to join in that first chain one. Now I can pull that yarn end and close up the hole. Chain one and turn. Single crochet in the next stitch. Two single crochet in the next. One, two. Single crochet in the next stitch. Two single crochet in the next one and two single crochet, two single crochet, one and two, and single crochet in the last stitch, slip stitch to join. Now I'm going to repeat that chain one and turn single crochet, two single crochet, one, two, one single crochet, one, two single crochet, one, and two. And I'm going to repeat that all the way around. So one, two, one, two, One, two, and one in the last stitch, and slip stitch to join. And I'm going to repeat that for one more row. Chain one and turn, make one single crochet, two single crochet, one single crochet, two single crochet. I'm going to repeat that all the way around. One and two. One and two. And at the end of the row, I'm going to slip stitch to join. And now there won't be any more increases, so it'll be chain one and turn, one single crochet in each stitch around. So a single crochet in each stitch all the way around. Okay, I finished that row and I'm going to do that for one more row. So I'm going to chain one. I'm going to work in the opposite direction. I can always tell by looking and seeing which way the stitches go. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to single crochet in each stitch all the way around. Okay, I worked all the way around. I'm going to slip stitch to join and fasten off. And that's going to be the head. Now I'm going to bring these two colors over. So I'm going to attach my yarn in that fasten off stitch. So pull the yarn through. And I'm just going to lock it in with both the yarn end and the working yarn. And I'm going to single crochet in each stitch across the row. So just one single crochet in each stitch all the way around. all the way around. Okay, I worked all the way around. Slip stitch to join. And now I'm going to chain three. One, two, three. And I'm going to turn. And that chain three will take the place of the first triple crochet. Single crochet in the next stitch. Triple crochet. Yarn around the hook two times. And then complete the stitch. Pick, pick up the yarn and pull it through. 
pick up the yarn, pull it through two, pick up the yarn, pull it through two, pick up the yarn, pull it through two. And that's a triple crochet, single crochet in the next stitch, triple crochet in the next stitch, single crochet in the next stitch. And I'm going to repeat all the way around, making a triple crochet and a single, a triple and a single. Okay, I worked all the way around. And this is my the equivalent of my first triple crochet. And I ended with a single crochet. And I'm going to slip stitch to join in the bottom of that chain three. So now I'm going to chain one and turn. And I'm going to make one single crochet in each stitch all the way around. So one single crochet. All the way around. Okay, I worked all the way around and I slip stitch to join in the first single crochet. And I'm going to chain three, one, two, three. And I'm going to single crochet in the next stitch triple crochet in the next stitch, single crochet in the next stitch. And I'm going to repeat that all the way around. All the way around. Okay, I worked all the way around. Now I'm going to repeat these two rows. I'm going to do one row of single crochet and then one row of triple crochet, single crochet, triple crochet, single crochet. Okay, I completed one more segment. So that was one row of single crochet, one row of triple and single, one row of single, one row of single and triple, one row of single, and then one row of triple and single. Now I'm going to start decreasing for the back. So we'll chain one and turn, and in the next stitch, I'm just going to pull up one loop. In the next stitch, I'm going to pull up a loop, and then I'm going to complete my single crochet. So in the next stitch, pull up a loop, in the next stitch, pull up a loop, complete the single crochet. So now you can see I just have this small opening in the back. So now I'm going to stop and stuff the body. Okay, so now I'm going to stuff it. I've got some stuffing in there already. And if you take the eraser end of a pencil, you can push that filling exactly where you want it. So I'm going to stuff it so that the nose is a little bit pointy. And I'm going to just do one more row of single crochet. So chain one and turn, single crochet in each stitch around. Okay, when I went to edit my videos, for some reason, there's no section and the eyes did not tape. So what I did was I threaded some black yarn into a yarn needle and then I just went over and over and over, just around and around until I had the nose section covered. And then with the needle and thread, I sewed some black beads on for eyes. And there you go. That's how you can crochet a cute little hedgehog. Thanks for watching. Bye for now.